All right, Taylor Ham, 24-7 Sports, visiting with top 247 wide receiver from Manville, uh, Jalen Preston. Um, not a whole lot has changed since the last time we talked a couple weeks ago, Jalen, but you did take a visit to Baylor. Wanted to get your thoughts on that. Uh, Baylor was a, it was a nice visit. I mean, nice to meet all the new coaching staff. You know, uh, I know some people not giving them another chance because of what happened, but I mean, they'll, 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 be, they'll be in my top, top schools uh, because, because, I mean, they throw the ball. And I like, like they take shots downfield. I like a uh, school that takes shots downfield. What's the uh, visit schedule look like? Maybe after spring ball and in the summer, any, any key spots you got to hit up? Uh, I don't know yet. I don't know. I know I'm going, might be going to Oklahoma again. I should, I should be going to Oklahoma again. I should go to a and again, uh, Ole Miss, I should go there again, Texas, I should go there again, and I, I don't know right, as of right now, it's a big summer. Any head coaches taking the time to, to you know, reach out to you, talk to you frequently? Oh uh, yes, I, you know, I just got got back from Baylor, I talked to the, uh, talked to the head coach, you know, he was a, a really, really cool guy, you know, down there guy, you know, he says, he, and then while I was talking to him, he said he can, uh, Said uh, when I'm ready to uh, play him in basketball, you know, <laughs> it's a little little joke, honey. I mean, I, I let him think that he can beat me. <laughs> uh, any other head coaches like reaching out to you, talking to frequently? Uh, I know Tennessee's head coach just uh, follow me on Twitter. Uh, Oklahoma head coach, um, who else? Coach Sumlin has reached out to me a couple of times. You know, just 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 checking in on me. You know, yeah. see, see how I'm doing. Uh, where are things at with you right now, man? You still pretty wide open. Uh, any any kind of attack you have planned, you know, in terms of uh, cutting it down? I should say, uh, about my top school is be coming soon. How many do you think you're gonna be dropping? About twelve. About twelve. Awesome. Right and, uh, I know you kind of want to keep that secret, but any any in particular that you feel like uh, you know are absolutely gonna make that cut? Oh yeah, um, I know the visit to I know Ole Miss and. Oklahoma, LSU. I took those visits recently. Uh, you know, I, I'm pretty sure they'll make my top and 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 them. Awesome. What's the latest with the Aggies right now, man? Um, you t still talking with Coach McKinney, and Coach Moorhead a lot? Yes, I am. I'm talking to them a little a little bit. They tell me uh, how the how the spring is going, how's, uh, how the players doing. Um, when's the last time you were up there again? Was it the Friday night lights? Friday night lights. Um, yeah. You know what, what really stood out to you? Um, I guess early playing time uh, for uh, I know I seen I told you about uh, Jamon. Yeah. You know just Justin Roden already he was starting at the uh, Friday Night Lights game did real real good real real good. And is there anything you're still kind of looking to see from those guys either in the fall or you know or is there still more relationship building that needs to happen? It's still a little bit more relationship building. What's it like with uh, Coach Moorhead, Coach McKinney? Oh, they're really 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 cool guys. You know uh, always. I always talk to them, talk to them. I mean, they, they could be family. Still looking like uh, maybe the Under Armour game or signing day for a decision? Yeah, not the Under Armour. I say signing day. Signing I mean, day. That's what my decision is going to be. Okay, great. Yeah. Appreciate the time, my man. No problem.